It's time to fight under the full moon. We are outside live at Empire Fight Camp. I'm Todd Grisham. Alongside me, English fighting legend Johnny Nelson. It's going to be unbelievable. The fans, everybody around the world, the fighters, this is just one of those things. It's time for our tale of the tape. And up first, it's Miss GB, Natasha Jonas, who's 173 centimeters tall with 165 centimeter reach. And she'll be facing Ebony, the blonde bomber Bridges, fights out of New South Wales, Australia, and won the IBF Bantamweight title in March of 2022. We'll be talking about this fight for years to come. This is one of those classic fights that everybody wants to see. Natasha Jonas, Miss GB. She fights out of Liverpool, England, and won the WBO junior middleweight title in February of 2022. Ebony the Blonde Bomber Bridges, fighting from Down Under in New South Wales, Australia. She won the IBF Bantamweight title in March of 2022. It'll be ding ding from first bell, they're off. Well, that's how things look on paper, but this is why they fight. Here we go. This bout is scheduled for 10 rounds of boxing. Hiding out of the red corner from Liverpool, England, here is the five-time champion at 64 kilograms, a two-time world title challenger, introducing Natasha Jonas. Fighting out of the blue corner, fighting out of New South Wales, Australia, a women's Australian super bantamweight champion, Ebony, the blonde bomber, Bridges. They'll be fighting under the lights tonight. What a unique environment as we get set for this high-energy right. showdown. The clouds have held the rain back. It's getting breezy. It's getting darker. The fans are getting desperate. They want to get involved in this fight. And now the action's about to begin. You can't imagine how bad these fighters want to get their hands on each other. Throwing the hook, but it doesn't score. Are we about to see a first-round knockout? How is she still on her feet? A much better game plan here. She's trying to buy some time here. Some nice exchanges. One, two, three, four, five. Final. And a round that seemed like an eternity for them finally comes to a close. Looks absolutely exhausted. What are you going to tell him in the corner? And there's the bell for round two. She just misses with that big right hand. Left punch. It's fight night, and as you can see, it is night as we fight under the stars for this big, highly anticipated main event. The only time you see atmospheres like this is Cinco de Mayo when you've got a massive fight in Mexico and all the fans have been partying all day waiting for the fight. They are the party. 
Now, the action, the entertainment is a fighter. If you're that fighter, they've been waiting for all day. So much for defense. Oh, and that changes everything. And down they go. One, two. Final three. 10 seconds here, and it's been a good round for her for sure. Well, Johnny, they've got the momentum, they've got the advantage. How do they carry that into the next round? I seriously hope the judges kept their eye on this fight because if they haven't, there's going to be absolute uproar. Do you there's the bell for round three. Not a lot of defense here at all. Nice punch. Off the charts action from both of these fighters. Some nice exchanges from both women in this round. You'd like to see more jabs. Just misses with the right uppercut. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. This one could go either way. Every round is so important. That was super tight. I dread being a judge. Who's going to be the first one to get buzzed? It doesn't always pay to be first. It pays to be last. The winner of this surely will get a world title shot. There's a right hand. Some nice exchanges from both women in this round. She blocks the hook. Which one of these athletes is going to say, I can't take it anymore? A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. This fight could not be any closer, could it, Johnny? It's too hard to split. Do you listen to your head or your heart? This Who's going to be the first one to get rocked? Punch scores. Got out of the way of that right hook. This fighter is not interested in throwing one shot at a time. They throw combinations and they throw them nonstop. I've never seen a fighter so fast in my life. How do you deal with this? You've got to hope, you've got to hope they run out of steam. Some nice exchanges from both women in this round. Big hook. 
Good thing it didn't land. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. I don't know which fighter is winning this bout. So important, the referee's got to do his fight right. He's got to judge this right. He's got to do his job right. Which one of these athletes is going to be the first to go down? Coming back to life now, starting to land some punches. Nice right uppercut by her. I think it's safe to say one of these fighters certainly has a significant speed advantage. You can tell who it is. Some fighters are just gifted. Gifted with such hand speed, footwork, movement. They are gifted. They are the chosen few. Some nice exchanges from both women in this round. Ten seconds here, and it's been a good round for her, for sure. Well, we know they've got the advantage so far, Johnny, but how does this match get turned around? As long as they don't get complacent, you think this is too easy. If they keep this same kind of pace up, they've got this fight. And here comes round seven. Where was the defense? Oh, and that changes everything! And down they go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Power punch hurt her. Why aren't they keeping their gloves up? So far, it seems like aggression has been the final 10 seconds here, and it's been a good round for her for sure. Not much to write home about in that round, huh, Johnny? Come on, give him a break. Let's round eight, and we're off again. That one will count. What a massive... And they're down, running out of time as the referee continues the count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, you're out! So time to go celebrate after another knockout win here. A knockout victory. That's not a knockout victory. That is somebody saying, I'm here. I've arrived. Try that again. It will happen all over again.